Hey guys, this is Canfree15 and I'm back out with another video for you guys and I'm back with another One Piece anime episode review for you guys. Um, now, if you're wondering why I'm uploading this super late, um, this is actually going to be this video is actually going to be going up Tuesday. Obviously, you guys see it. You're, if you're wondering why is this video going up so late instead of Saturday, um, something in my personal life came up and it was kind of had me down a bit um, with something. I'm going to keep it personally to myself. Um, but, um, I just didn't do any recordings that day and even Sunday. Um, so that's why you guys also didn't see, if you check out my My Hero Academia chapter reviews, manga chapter reviews, that's why I didn't do that. But I am going to be actually recording that after, <coughs> excuse me, excuse me, after I make that video and it's going to be going up to, um, Monday. But, um, the thing is, yeah, something crazy in my personal life happened. And it kind of pissed me off slash got me a little bit sad a bit, but hey, like everything, you gotta move on from those stuff. But um, the one thing is I did see the One Piece episode, even though I wasn't feeling, you know, my my uh, head wasn't too much into the game. But um, this episode, we finally get the return of one of the more newer recent Straw Hat Pirates um, on the crew, and that is Jinbei. And this is the first time we've seen Jinbei since the whole cake island arc when he said his goodbye telling luffy he's going to stay behind and help his former crew you know escape the big mom pirates and everything now um we'll get to that um now obviously the episode starts off with the whole thing with conjuro escaping away from momonosuke and everything and he's on a swan escaping now, Kawamatatsu eventually gets uh, Shinobu out of the snake wrappers, the snakes that were wrapping her up. So what happens next up is because they see Momonosuke captured by Kondro, all the others are informed. So the other strats are informed that Kondro was a traitor and he's got Momonosuke and he's doing everything. Also too, um, the beast pirate ship is sailing away from them and they're getting farther away as possible. So what we see is Sanju tries to go up there and he tries to get Momonosuke back, but essentially Kanjiro gets the upper hand on him a bit and Sanji's not able to do that. But Sanji tries to go back up, but that's when um, Kanjiro comes with this thing. He creates these dark black clouds, but these dark black clouds start raining these sharp like thing. These sharp like, I guess you can say, you know, little dagger like things. Um, are like, I guess, splinter things. And it's just falling down on all of them. So everybody's trying to get under cover, to take cover and stuff like that, pre preventing it. So some allies are getting hit by it. Um, most of the swordsmen are trying to just deflect the bullets and everything and getting, and getting out of it and stuff like that. So that was pretty freaking interesting. I've, I died when Nami was about to get hit by some of them and Sanji's like, I'll protect you, Nami, son. And he's taking all the brunt of the attack. But technically, he could just coat his back with hockey and it probably isn't going to affect him. So that could be the thing there. That's why it doesn't feel like he's taking so much pain. But I think he would still take that much pain for Nami. Um, who won it? Anyways, um, so essentially, Luffy sees this and Momonosuke is crying and everything. And obviously, essentially, Kanjiro's kind of berating him. He's like, oh, man, you're just a freaking crybaby of a kid, just like you were back then. And that's when Luffy calls out to Momonosuke. He's like, you know, Momonosuke, don't worry. Just do your best to stay alive, and I'll come save you. And that gives Momonosuke some hope and stuff like that. And then that's when he cries out to, obviously, the allies and says, I'll be waiting for you guys to come save me. Um, so Momonosuke is looking to be a little bit more braver as time is progressing and everything. So eventually it seems like he flies off. He's going to be headed to Onigashima. That's when Luffy gets back on the sun. He's telling him, all right, let's go ahead to Onigashima now. Now, the next thing is the Beast Pirate ship is starting to fire off these long range cannons and they're starting to hit some of the allies ships, forces and everything. And it's in the point where it's looking bad. And the more this keeps up, the more men they're going to lose in the battle. Um, and stuff like that. But then that's when we see under the sea, we see Jinbei take care of the ship himself and destroy it. And that's when when the Sunnies joining, you know, sailing up, um, they 
Luffy and the others see through, obviously, the rubble and the smoke. They see it's Jinbei, and Jinbei's, Jinbei's like, I'm back, and I'm here to fulfill my duty as a straw hat pirate. And I, he's like, Luffy, I'm back, like you prom like I promised you that I would be back, and hey, let's go kick some butt. I got 10 showed up at the right time. Um, so Jinbei finally returns to their straw hat pirate crew. So now you can officially, now we can officially say the straw hat pirates are all collectively together again. I like the fact that Law and Kid were both shocked. Like this dude, the the Straw Hats now have a uh, former warlord, uh, person of the sea, Jimbei, on their pirate crew now. What the hell, man? Um, and stuff like that. So it was nice to see Jimbei again. Definitely nice to see Jimbei now. The thing about Jimbei is we don't know what happened after the battle with Big Mom. Now it's gonna be interesting to see. If he'll explain what happened and how he how he was able to escape that along with the other um, crewmates of his former crew of his the new Fishman Pirates, um, so yeah, we don't know if say Big Mom did anything or something. He seems a okay for now, um, but it's really great to see Jinbei again. It's been a long, long time since we've seen Jinbei. Um, I don't know how many years in terms of the anime we've seen Jinbei. But I think it's been a while. At least it had to be at least over a year or two. Um, if you know that, please put the answer. If it was, I think it's been at least more than two years that we have since the last time we've seen Jinbei. Um, but it's great to see Jinbei reunited with the Straw Pirates, reunited with Luffy. Um, and yeah, and it seems like he's going to be helping in the Battle of Onigashima, which definitely we need. More stronger allies, the better. But other than that, that's kind of it. So if you guys liked the video, leave a like, put in the comment section your thoughts on this week's episode of One Piece, as well as hit that subscribe button if you want to get more um, One Piece anime episodes reviews going forward. And again, sorry um, for not updating you guys, but it was really kind of a troubling thing. But hey, it's fine. I'm feeling much better. Um, so yeah, other than that, I'm going to get out of here. Hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day. And I'm going to check out this video. Until then, guys, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.